Hello everybody and welcome to the Eden Audio YouTube channel. My name's Adam and I'm the owner of Eden Audio. Eden Audio are based in Copford St Luke, Somerset, which is in the United Kingdom. You can also visit our webpage at edenaudio.uk. Good morning everybody, welcome back to the Eden Audio YouTube channel. It's a glorious sunny day here in Copford St Luke. Actually, I think I may be pushing it a little bit saying it's glorious sunny, but it's certainly we can see a little bit of sun trying to push through, which makes a bit of a change. I hope you're all well, everybody. I hope you've all been listening and enjoying your music this past few days. If you watched the last video I made, I was talking about the new Orn X5S 6th anniversary. Now, I'd like to update you a little bit on that before we move into the next presentation, which is going to be of the new Orn S6 Pro headphone amplifier and DAC. I'd just like to backpedal a little bit and talk about something about the X5S 6th anniversary, and that is regarding the hard disk. Now, I have found out that you can actually put it by artist and album where I said you can just put it by the album without the artist if that makes sense but you can actually put it artist then their albums but the problem I've come across is that it seems to have a capacity a memory capacity of around the same as what the SD card is of about 120 128 gigabyte of memory so once you go over that even though your hard disk may be say 500 giga or 1 TB once you go over that 120 odd gigabyte you can't put any more music to it. As I said, there is going to be an update from all and hopefully that will sort out that problem because I don't see the point of having a 500 gigabyte hard drive and only being able to use 120 odd gigabyte of it. I'll keep you updated on that. But as I say, this morning, we are looking at the new Orn S6 Pro. I've had this here about a month or so. It's an updated version of the very popular and very successful S6. As I say, we are now looking at the Pro version. Now, Orn have thrown a bit of a curveball here because you've now got a choice of two DACs. Okay, one's more expensive than the other, and one, as you notice, also contains a headphone amplifier, but there is a huge difference between the two of them, which is really quite interesting, and that is that Orn have chosen to use two different types of DAC chips. Now in the Orn X8 Pro, which I've also shown in another video, interestingly, they've gone for the ESS Sabri chip. But in the S6 Pro, they've gone for an AKM chip. Now that doesn't sound like much, but there is quite a sonic difference between the two of them. People have commented on that the ESS Sabri chip can be quite analytical and bright sounding, and I would probably tend to agree with that. If you've heard the X8 DAC, Magic DAC presentation that I've made, you can hear that it is a very dynamic, very, very highly detailed sounding DAC, where on the other hand, the AKM to me sounds more warmer, more, uh, more, analog sounding, sweeter, more richer. So you've got a, a bit of a problem when it comes to choosing what type of DAC you want. So Warren have given you a choice of two sonic flavors. You can have a more analytical sound, which is found in the XA, even that you can slightly tune, as I said, by changing the op amps in it, but the sound is generally more analytical in the XA, or you can go, or you can go for something like the S6, which has got the AKM DAC chip, which will give you a more analog, warmer type of sound. Is it worth spending more? Well, that all depends really on whether or not you need the headphone amplifier because you obviously are paying for a top quality headphone amplifier output and a DAC as well. But if you don't need the headphone, then obviously you could save yourself a little bit of money by getting the X8 DAC on its own. I think I want to come out with another superb quality product here. The build quality, I must say, on all products is absolutely outstanding. I remember years ago when people used to call things chi-fi in a kind of derogatory manner, or thinking that if it was made from China, it wasn't going to be any good, it was going to catch on fire or blow up or not last for more than a week as soon as you got it in your home. That is simply not true. 
Chinese manufacturing now to me is exemplary. You get excellent value for money. The build quality on them is stunning. People don't complain when they buy their iPhones from Apple or their Apple computers. That's also made in China. The Chinese are turning out some absolutely outstanding audio products. And Orn are one of those manufacturers who are at the forefront pushing the technology, the audio DAX, to make them better and better. And each generation, each improvement they make, you get more for your money. Really, honestly, is outstanding value.